Am I the asshole? For telling my daughter that I'll be missing her graduation to attend my son's. I have two children, my daughter May is 21 and my son Luke is 17. May's father and I split shortly after she was born, and I met my now husband when she was about a year old. Due to work and life circumstances, May primarily stayed with her father but visited us on the weekends when she was younger. She's an incredibly bright girl, she has an AA, she's about to graduate with her BA, and she's been accepted into a master's program that starts in the fall. I'm so proud of her, I can't say that enough. My son Luke is graduating from high school this year, and I found out that his graduation is a few days after my daughter's. We don't live very close by anymore, so it would be back and forth flights which just doesn't feel practical. Since May is getting another degree, I've told her that I'll attend her next graduation, but this time I'm just going to attend her brother's since graduating high school is such a big step. May seemed a little upset at first but she told me it was fine and that she understood. My ex called me later and told me that I wasn't considering May's feelings in the slightest. Her HS graduation in 2020 was cancelled due to lockdown, then her ceremony for her AA was virtual for the same reason, so now that she's finally having one, my not going has really hurt her. I told my ex that I'd go to her next one, and that it's not fair that I just not show up for her brother. He says that it's more than possible for me to come see her graduate and then fly back in time to see my son do the same. My thing is that yes, it's possible, but it isn't practical. May told me herself that she is a little upset about it, which is why she vented to her dad, but she apologized for making it an issue. I don't know how to feel about this now. Am I being an ah here? ETA. My daughter found this post, which wasn't my intention, but I did reach out to her to apologize for not being considerate of how this was going to make her feel. I'm going to fly out earlier to spend more time with her and to attend her graduation ceremony. You're the asshole. You're acting like your daughter is an inconvenience to you. My thing is that yes, it's possible, but it isn't practical. You're the asshole. You are choosing not to attend when you very well can be there. You just don't want to be bothered to go out of your way to do it. You're the asshole. It's not practical to support both your children. Gotcha. You're the asshole. I go to your next one is so shitty. And it is completely your decision to not fly in earlier or to just suck it up and put in effort. You deem to really be a weekend parent to the heart. You're the asshole. I wonder why your kid ended living with her father full time. You're the asshole. Your ex is right you don't care about her feelings. You've missed two of her ceremonies now technically. You've also proven to your daughter where she stands in your life and it shows you care more about your son than her. That's why she's apologizing for your decision, because she feels let down by her own mother. High school means nothing in the long run, and your daughter is a superstar. You're the asshole, it isn't fair to pick between your son and daughter. If it's possible to go to both, then you should. Even if it doesn't seem practical. My other question is why is it even relevant of which parent she grew up with primarily? Both are your children. It shouldn't matter if she grew up with her dad. Info what was your plan if let's say your son graduation was LL still have to fly there won't you? You're the asshole. You state, numerous times, that it's possible for you to make it to both but you're not willing to put in the effort. You obviously don't value your daughter's accomplishments as much as your son's. If you did, you would be making the trip, not making excuses. You're the asshole. That's some low-down parenting. You're more worried about the inconvenience of travel and not your child's feelings. You're the asshole. Doesn't feel practical? Feelings and practicality usually don't fit together. Book a flight and be there for her. Yes? You'll spend, yes you'll be tired, yes it's a pain in the butt, however good parents endure a little pain to keep their children from feeling unloved. Book now, update us when you are done.
Info when you say it is impractical, do you mean in terms of cost, time or what? What would it require to pull this off? You're the asshole. Go to both. Sorry baby I'm not going to your first real graduation because it is just not practical. Also you say that you are proud of her why not show her by going? Hugging her and telling her there? Graduation is a big thing especially the first. You're the asshole, who cares if it's practical. Spend the extra money, bust ass and do both. Run between airport gates, take Ubers, whatever it takes. You're the asshole. I graduated college on a Saturday in a different state, and my sister graduated high school in our home state on the following Wednesday. Yes, it was highly inconvenient, and we were all frazzled and tired when it was all done, but neither of my parents considered skipping either one. Stop acting like you're not playing favorites. You didn't even get to attend her high school graduation due to lockdown. Be a good parent, and attend both events. You're the asshole you have two children, not one. You owe it to them both to be there. And it can be done, you just don't want to. In four years, when Luke is graduating from college at the same time that May is earning her masters will you still choose Luke and try to justify it? You're the asshole. Why did my dog test top Tialkian to me? I'm sorry but I do feel like you're the asshole, especially given the other cancelled graduations. Why not the flights back and forth? Sure might be a bit exhausting but you'd be there for both your children. I'm sure it's not often they graduate. Plus I don't feel like HS graduation is on the same level as master's graduation. And what happens life happens and she doesn't finish the next degree. You're the asshole. If May was as important to you as Luke, you would make it work. By refusing to do what it would take to go to both, you're choosing your favorite May and your ex sees it, so do random internet strangers. The graduations are not on the same days, nor are they literally back to back. You just don't want to put in the time and effort for May. You're the asshole. You're the asshole, if it's possible for you to do it you need to do it. This isn't about your comfort, you aren't going on vacation, even if it's a pain to fly on back to back days, do it for your kids. Your daughter will always remember that you didn't show up for her when you could have. Do you want to be that kind of mum? You're the arsehole I'm sorry but you can't pick. Your daughter is going to feel like you hate her. She likely already feels hurt around not seeing you much growing up and now you are picking her half-brother over her. If you do this, she will always believe you like him more. This is an important event in both of their lives, you need to be there for both if you don't want her to forever have hurt feelings. You're the asshole. You should be willing to move mountains to attend both and you definitely can do that, even if it is a little inconvenient for you. Your favoritism is awful and your response is overly insensitive. You're the asshole. If you are able to go to both graduations, then you should. Who cares if it's not practical? Your daughter sees this as favoritism which it really isn't as you ignoring all the hard work she's put into getting her degree. I'll just go to her next one, is a dick thing to say.